on Biomutant fights, I think you would fucking throw your remote if you played that game. That game was awesome, though. Yeah, it was, but that, the best that racer fight, in North or South America. it made no sense. It was just dumb. Nice to meet you too, William. Like, okay. Shall we do this? I vote to kick this fight out of here. Oh, this is this an LFA? I've seen and sat one of these in person. They're rare. Where I grew up, somebody bought one of these cars and they totaled it the next day, so it went to my buddy's shop. So I got to touch and help fix and everything with it. It was crazy. We're like, someone owns an LFA in this little town? Hey, what's up? You just had to figure out how to do it. I came over there and did it on a controller. Fucking made me do it on the controller. I fucking beat one of those fights for you with a. Cody brought it up because he said, You need Bolter to come finish this for you? Literally. I got to get there. How many more miles? No, fuck. They gave me eight minutes to photograph that tornado, and it took me a minute. They only gave me two minutes and 50 seconds to race three miles. Come on. The server's tripping out. All right. You should go. I am. I don't know what it is about Disneyland, Disney World, Wonderland, Six Flags. I just have no appeal to that shit. What? You don't yeah. like them? I don't know. Just nothing in my mind is pulling me towards going to do that right now. Wow. <laughs> that sucks. No, it's just <laughs> honest. Like, I just don't. It's no appeal. Well, I can't cross the border anyway, so you should definitely go do it if it's what you want to do. Well, we don't know if it's going to be a year still or what, but at least in Canada, I can do shit. I mean, if you want to go to Wonderland for the day, I'll go fuck, go to Wonderland. But I'm not making a huge fucking trip going somewhere that has no appeal. Wonderland's just a day thing, you know? It's fucking half an hour away. It's all about how you see things. Yeah, and that's how I see it. So what's your point? So fun. Eh. Why, why are you talking like that? It's my opinion, and you're debating my opinion. So of course I'm gonna get all like that. I'm not debating your opinion. I'm just saying it's like all about how you see it, and um. There's better things. That's how I see it. Eh. I don't know, Coots. Well, you know what? I can't really let you know until your president lets me in. So, the states is kind of off the trading block. I mean, it's you guys too. You guys don't allow numbers. Yeah, you can come in. You got to quarantine 14 days. Yep. Well, you got. You can cross the border without Vax. You can't fly to Canada without Vax. Oh. What's driving on? I can't even drive to the States. Not on. That's not. Not on us. Not on me, man. Not, not on you either. <laughs> Just a government thing. 
what is it though? Two more weeks and kind of get some of my life back. That's going to be great. Yeah. I mean, the gym wants to charge me for a membership. <laughs> I can't even fucking use it. Did you put it on pause? Yeah, I can only pause it for so many weeks without breaking contract though. Wow, that's not right. Well, they don't charge you when it's closed because no no one can go there. Course, but I can only but pause it in my contract for so long okay, when... Say you have a year contract and you're not vaccinated and obviously you have to be vaccinated to go there. Are they going to seriously say you're breaking your contract because you're canceling and you can't go? You can go, you just chose not to fucking do what the world wants you to do. No, but you can't go because... I can, if I go get a needle. Yeah, but I'm saying like, they're really going to penalize you for that? I mean, if, you know, if it was a big thing, I'm not even saying, I don't even care, I'm just saying, like, I can't, like, I'm getting charged for it. Have you been paying all this whole time? No, like, the last three weeks. Um. And it's still cheaper than going to the other gyms, because I have a great fucking thing. Just saying. You have that the Planet Fitness shit. <laughs> no, I'm on, uh... Fit life 24 7. It's so good life is the biggest brand in Canada. And they have these little 24 7 shacks that they own, but they're rebranded. Don't put this on my record. good night, man. It was fun, William. Thanks for hanging out. I'm saying our equivalent is Planet Fitness. It's like today, my sister's like, I'm like me. It's only like 10 bucks a month. I was like, oh my god. The place is so ghetto, though. Oh, oh. this is the one oh, right beside Sana. Booster Juice. Like, it's brand new, it's beautiful. Yeah, massage, really chairs, hydro, massage, everything. Yeah, they have that too, but it's gross. Like, you can, yeah, she was like, dude. <laughs> I love that place. I put paper towels on the floor when I step on it, and it's that bad. <laughs> well, America's a little bit different, I guess. Planet Fitness tried to come here, they went bankrupt. Kind of like Target. It's like anything with a fucking American flag comes here, goes under. A lot of stuff. Target didn't last a fucking year, you know how much money that cost them? I'm sure. <laughs> Craziness. There's so much stuff out there that we have. Something that could really fucking be successful in the States. Canada computers. I do see some micro centers popping up. They look cool, but I don't know how they compete price wise and shit. Is that other place? What was it called? Fries? That place is a fucking joke. Southern Wookie, what up, dude? Um, thanks for the follow. The only thing that's worthwhile at Six Flags is the coasters, the rest is just a waste of cash. Does Six Flags not have a big ass water park? What do you say hell no to? Tony, he's always he comes up in here and tells me something new every day. From what I heard, Micro Center and Canada computers are pretty similar. Isn't here. What? She's running operations in the UK and Australia was a long pretty time meh. ago. You playing Forza Wookie? Difference to me. Hey Tristan, Tegan, I guess we're racing. It's certainly not a social. It's a much deeper story. Sorry, famous. Oh, wow. I missed your. Well, okay. Let's go then. Visually gorgeous. Like how gorgeous? Like, like Spider-Man gorgeous? Like, uh, what's the what's the most visually aesthetic game that you played? Like, Detroit Become Human. That was pretty nutty. That was pretty amazing. Like the graphics. They got water parks, but the Midwest one is blah. Calling hmm. Jay, look up Tegan Ashley. One sec. I mean, I'm down for a water park, but I can't see a water park being fully opened in the fucking... Where the government is with all this shit right now. It's like a cesspool. But I don't think of it. I just go to have fun. That, when they introduced that that wave ri riding thing where you try to surf the wave, the artificial wave, I never done that. 
I think that'd be awesome. Kind of like snowboarding on a wave, you know? I never did it before. Oh, that's fun. They have that in San Diego. I love it. That's the best place to learn. You don't have to worry about fucking getting attacked by a shark or fucking drowning in the ocean. Am I racing this guy? Ooh! Photograph. Just wear a mask and you'll be fine. Get the fuck out of here. Wear a mask in the water park. But look at me, guys! That's really stupid. <laughs> Imagine? Uh, yeah. Let's get the mask wet so it absorbs even more shit. Um, I can't wait to... The Our Gamers open. XL. Dang, that Mazda needs an exhaust. What Mazda? I'm not racing a Mazda, am I? I once went to this Cajun food place in a different state. Keep in mind, I was born, sand raised in Louisiana. That food was so horrible. It's the only time I didn't want to bring leftovers home. Wait, what did I say for you to make, make you say that? Random, Southern. But hey. Why are you eating an experiment? Like, Louisiana food is so good. You don't need to fucking go out of state to get any of that shit, do you? If you want something fried, you need to go to La Louisiana. God damn. What's that dessert? Um, bread pudding. Yum. I must say, though, that drink that y'all are fucking crazy about, what's it called? The fucking uh, hurricane? That's, I don't really like that. That's just fucking a sugar rush. Picking those locks, Jazz, reminds me of scum. Mm -hmm. Like, it's straight up the same. Thanks for the follow, Ski. Or why do I call you Ski? SXL? We're just gonna call you D-Gen. <laughs> <laughs> like on Letterkenny? The fucking D-Gen. The game sound is low. Yeah, unless you just want to hear fucking... <laughs> all for like 12 hours. Is that, is that what you want? Nothing's your bad, bro. I just didn't know where you got that. Hold on. You were out of state for a vacation. And I thought we were talking about how other states can't do the OG state stuff. Fair enough. I don't think we, we brought that up. But, hey, I like combo. You miss playing scum. You want the fucking burnout sounds? Okay, here, let me raise it like two ticks. Just for you. Canada versus the US in what? We're talking about Olympics now? Ooh! Son of a bitch. I missed no. the medal by two seconds. No, no, no! I can't race my way in. I can't buy my way in. What do you want from me? Easy, Tegan. Are you all right? Forget about Born Fast. If you want to race for Horizon for a while, businesses are talking ahead. about that. That's absolutely fine. Why? Like they'd have me now. Nobody takes me seriously. All because of my family's stupid money. Are you kidding? We'd love to have you. Oh, you're yes, from the Netherlands. Here's who your mum is. Do you ride a bicycle every day? Just wondering. Because like 50% of the population does. It's like one of the only places in Europe, other than like Scandinavia and UK, that I haven't been. I was right on the border. I regret not going. I did meet some really nice people in France that were from the Netherlands though. Like a bunch of them. They used to send me a Christmas card every year. I met them for like two weeks and they sent me a Christmas card for like the next five years. You don't get that shit anymore. I 
right? You've only been to Greece? Unless you count the... No, we, let's not count airports. <laughs> Zurich. Switzerland's nice. It's expensive. And depends, like, what you define as nice. Like, going up into the mountains is nice for everybody. Oof. Yeah, I've been there a few times now. Oh, I missed the fucking check. Ugh. It's alright. It's like a side mission while we're on a mission. Outside of that trip, you you never been to Canada or Mexico, Elf? Like your easiest two spots? When you were super young, you went to Canada for a day? What, for like uh, Niagara Falls or something? Where's this? Oh, there it is. I'm in the top 70% leaderboard for Forza now. Hell yeah. Jazz is like super focused. Or muted, one or the other. How come you're so fucking low? I'm just not talking well. There we go. I just turned you up. i never been to Asia, Coots. I wanted to go to Tokyo for a long time. A long mm -hmm. flight. Should call. Yeah, when I can afford it, I will. No use putting shit on credit card. I can afford it. Okay. Buy a ticket. Superstar, I believe you've spoken to Katya, my second in right. command. Alright. What do you mean? Okay. Maybe the second I mean, you want to do like after me. unguided adventures with me in Tokyo? Katya and I have been talking. Mm, I would be willing to do that with anybody. Fast. No, you're worried about Horizon safety and history. shit. Yeah. Oh, I guess so. I don't care who wins, Tristan. I'm here to have fun. <laughs> I told you he would refuse. No matter. Now we get to see who really is second. I mean, you can go with someone else. If you want. When the day comes, and I feel like Tokyo's on the agenda, I will go with whoever wants to go and can keep up. I don't know why it's always about keeping up with you, like, you know... Because I want to go to Tokyo you never... for what I want to do. You never said you wanted to go to Tokyo. I don't want to go for Tokyo for what you want to do. Oh, I literally want to go to Tokyo for what I want to do. So the other person doesn't matter? If it's a trip that... There's a reason why I want to go to Tokyo. And if you never said I want to go to Tokyo, then yes, it's for what I want to uh... do. So Just like the reason you want to go to yeah, Disneyland. Weird. I know it doesn't. Like, I mean, oh obviously my gosh. the other person goes there because they want to go They want to experience what I've laid out for them on that trip. But someone could, else could say, Yeah, that's why I want to go to Tokyo. Of course. I don't want to fucking sit in a hotel, do a guided tours and shit like that. No. Now, if someone said, Hey, Dan, I want to go to Germany. Now I do these. Rules and regulations. <laughs> I just know what I fucking want. Imagine she hasn't said anything for like ten minutes, and I say one thing about Tokyo, she's right on my ass again. I said I would buy you a ticket. Yeah, but if you're on mine, do you not see that? Okay, I don't care if someone wants to buy me a ticket if I can't do what I want to do because that's what you want to do. When did I ever say that? I Go lay on a beach, relax, that. do nothing, do guided tours for safety. I know the spiel. Well done, Katya. I knew you'd win. 
Okay, cool. Yeah, if I, I have an itinerary, know. like, what's the fucking big deal if that's the itinerary for the trip that I want to do? On every trip that I've ever been on, I think maybe one had a guided tour, and every other one we rented a car was on and a did beach. everything on our own. No, it wasn't. I've <laughs> been to a lot of places. Mostly on a beach. Okay. Do you okay. even know where I've been? Nice. Like, I don't know. Are you trying to, like, uh, do you not want to hang out with me or something? Like, Not all the time, no. This. When have you ever hung out with me without me asking? Like, it's, it's like, really sad. When I wake up every day. <laughs> what do you mean? I hang out with you every day when I wake up. Like it or not. We have no, we haven't hung out in a long time. What do you mean? In like ten days? Yeah. You said every day when you wake up. Yeah. Okay. So, other than you being away right now, we're together every day. Put it into context. God damn. We work too, you know. Thankfully. What do you mean thankfully? Are you to be rude to me? No, I'm not! Like, <laughs> I mean, god damn. Like shit, man. I want positivity and This is treating right you like shit? What? Yes. Oh, so I won't say anything then. I'll go mute for you. Me, you're telling me, like, what kind of trips I like? Yeah. And... Um, I'm just going on what you've told me. Yeah, if I'm in a weird, crazy country like i'm gonna be scared to go drive around if i can't even speak the language like jamaica for one is super dangerous well that's different that's jamaica and if i'm in like somewhere safer like then i'm definitely down to do cool shit when you're on a fucking beach resort in jamaica where there's barbed wire fences around your fucking resort yeah you're not going outside no oh, shit. That's okay. Exactly but I'm not about. talking I'm about a fucking one star fucking country on, like, no. Yeah. Japan's, yeah. like, more sophisticated than Canada and US. How am I supposed to follow this? I just, like, that's exactly what I was talking about, and then. Well, you definitely can't speak fucking whatever Japanese, I guess it would be. Oh, shit. I mean, is Tokyo a dangerous country? I don't really know anything about it. I mean, just like we have mafias and mobs and criminals, they do. I mean, is the states dangerous? Yeah, but I'm from here and I know the states. I know where to go and where not to, you know, like... Okay, but if you wanted to go to Detroit, do you know where to go and where not to go? <laughs> no, I'm not kidding. <laughs> no, don't I mean, I've been in New Orleans walking around and been five feet from a gun. See, but New Orleans is known for its tourists, you know? Like, New Orleans is crazy, and I've seen it. But, like, Detroit, it don't have no tourist areas. Like, this shit is... What do you mean? Better. Detroit has so much history. Yeah, but it's fucking scary. <laughs> Look at Elf. Where, how do not to go to Detroit! Here? Yeah, thank you. <laughs> yes, well done, Catch. Follow the cable. Oh. New Orleans is more dangerous than the Detroit. On a numbers <laughs> level. It? Yeah. Population to crime is crazy. Or, sorry. Yikes. Yeah, population to crime percentage. <clears throat> How am I supposed to get around that? Like saying let's oh, vacation in Chicago. <laughs> I always wanted to drive to Chicago. Like, go to Detroit, then go to Chicago. Cause it's oh, you ca don't speak Spanish? Sorry. I didn't mean to cut you off. No, you good. You guys stream too. I don't think they can hear me anyway, so you good. Well, no, I know, but... You know, like, I cut you off, so... It's fun for the day. That's all I could see myself going to Chicago for, kind of like the day. Detroit for the day, oh, Chicago for the day. Yeah, I mean, like, the girls, they just came back and they only went for two days. Like, it's nothing crazy. Around, like, you know, they only walked around the, the downtown tourist spots. Of course. How do I get up there? I would love to go, you know, to a Red Wings game 
Even though we don't have the Joe Louis Arena anymore, I'd love to see a Red Wings game. Love to see a Blackhawks game in Chicago. Um. This is hard. Okay, guys, look how bad the stuttering is. We're definitely restarting after this race. Oh my god. Can oh. I fucking. Oh, I'm cold. Oh, fuck. When you're, uh. You know what? First time I went all alone, but with my fucking 14 year old little friend. We you railed it across Europe alone. We didn't have fucking phones with internet. We didn't have any of that shit. We had papers with a map and when the train times were, and we just fucking went. It was great. Do I have one of those? You should take your best friend to go do that. What's her name? No. She's like my hiking best friend. Like extreme hiking oh. best friend. And played hockey tournaments and shit like that. It's so jazz, just S O L J A Z. I already told him. We're waiting for you. I've got better idea, Jake. Is this a race? Oh, good to have like that one go to homie who will go with you to do Well, I mean shit. she probably would. I never asked to go like outside of Canada States before. And usually if I do it's always like, yo, look at this sick ass fucking trail. So, what do you have planned, Ellie? Okay, I need... Well, serious. I did get a hold of a bare VW Beetle chassis, no. and I have built something from scratch. Papa Fernando would probably think I've gotten a little okay, bit longer. Okay, And you've got a Koenigsegg Let's see if this too, works. Because... I've never used this. Because we're going to race them, of course. This time I get That's not true, Elf. Don't hold anything back. Nope. Look, it's not working. My French class oh, wow. went to France and one of the teacher got mugged. That was a long time ago. You're on. I don't, where do I go? Someone got mugged where? France. I didn't go on a trip. My teacher got mugged at knife point. Oh, fuck. That's scary. Dude. Yeah, but did she just that's gave that's the shit. shit and they left her alone. I mean, that's fucking still scary. I mean, <laughs> shit's gonna shit. happen. Like, you need to be prepared. You need to know what to do. How to act. How to keep your cool. <laughs> wow. Like, oh, I can't get over this wall. If you haven't seen your life flash before your eyes like three or four times by now, then... Are you living? Yeah, I am living. <laughs> Quite happy yeah, but, without you know. being threatened. Well, then it just means it's bound to come yet if you haven't had that experience. Whether it be in a car, whether it be at someone else's will, whether it be... Why? That's scary, Dan. Yeah, well, it's just... Like, it humbles you. What? I'm humble without it. Well, whatever, I'm just... I never... I said that's just one of the things. I'm so stuck in this game right now. Like, bad stuck. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. It says to follow these cables, and I am. Oh, I blew it. Okay. Rewind. I know, I forgot how right great here. this soundtrack was on Death Stranding. See you again in 50 plus oh. hours. Yeah, I don't think you'll be finishing that. You could even fucking finish Biomutant. You're gonna finish Death Stranding? My ass. Who could? Yeah. I'm stuck. I'm 100% stuck in this game. I have to see that to believe it, right? Oh, this piece of poop car. Yo, doctor, thank you for the sub, man. <sighs> what up? Shout out. How are you? Holy. I'm 